Fossil Group sells fashion accessories, mostly rich wristwatches, uh, and they don't appear to be selling enough of them, Jason. Uh, oh, sure. Shares falling 30% this week after an absolutely brutal first quarter report. Yep. Guidance often trumps results, especially when the results suck. And their results were really, really bad. And their guidance, honestly, was really worse. Uh, I think the biggest problem for Fossil is that 75% of their sales come from watches, which, as you've noted before, that's just not seemingly the strongest sort of recurring purchase. You have, on one hand, sort of watch enthusiasts. You have, on the other hand, these people that are kind of making the switch to some sort of fitness device. Uh, and then, Folks in the middle there who just don't want to wear a watch, and, and and so you have this retailer with no real pricing power, no real sort of identity. Otherwise, uh, they're stuck with inventory getting a lot, you getting out of control. Margins start to, to get a little bit compressed, and we've already established we're in the face of a pretty weak consumer at this point in time. So, when when you, in the first quarter, when you offer up guidance for the full year like these guys did, it's no wonder the stock got shelled. And, and honestly, I don't know that there's a catalyst that turns this thing around anytime soon. So if you're looking for a retail idea, I think I'd steer clear from this one.